We'll guide you through how to download and install shaders in Minecraft 1.21.8. If you find this useful, then please consider subscribing and liking the video. Shaders go and add different lighting effects and shadows, and they can be a great addition to the game. So to go and get started, let's quit Minecraft. Here we are on the desktop. What you need to do is go and open up a web browser of your choice. And to get started, we're going to go and get a shader pack. So a great site we can get shader packs from is called Curse Forge. Loads of different Minecraft things on here, as well as other games as well. So come to curseforge.com, select Minecraft, press browse tool at the top, and you can scroll down, press shaders to the left. Now we can go and see different packs here. You can go and browse through them and you can click on them to go and see what they look like. Of course, you can actually get multiple packs as well and find your sort of favorite one. In this case, I'll go for this one here. You can scroll down and read about it. To get it, we can press files though, and then we can get it for 1.21.8 at the top. We'll press the three dots to the right and press download file. Now wait, we've now downloaded it. Now what we need to do is go and get something to go and run the shaders with. That is going to be called Iris Shaders. You can go and type it in just like so and add Minecraft and then come to the site irisshaders.dev. Here you can go and press download now. You can go and read about it if you want and we can go and get the universal jar. Click here and it's now downloaded. Next, you need to come out of your web browser and you need to go and open up your file explorer. You want to come to downloads. Before we get any further, a big shout out to Apex Hosting sponsoring this video. If you're in need of a Minecraft server, check out the link in the pinned comment and in the description. At the moment with Apex, you can get 25% off your first invoice, so they're definitely worth checking out. If we scroll down, we can start checking out some of their great features. Of course, with this, you can start playing with friends and other people. So they've got one click install mod packs, dealers protection, 24 seven servers and support, meaning you can get the help anytime you need it for your always online server and many other great features as well. So check them out below. Here you want to go and find Iris installer and you want to go and double click on it. It should go and run like this. If it doesn't, it's likely that you don't have Java. So what we can do is return to the web browser and you want to go to java.com, press download Java for desktops, download and install it like any other app. Then you want to return to Iris, right click, hover over open with, and press choose another app. Select Java and press always, and it will then go and run like so. Then if it still doesn't, you may need to do something called a jar fix, which links jar and jar files together. What you want to do is go and select 1.21.8 and press install at the bottom. It's now gone and completed as you can see. Now we can come and close this and you want to press search at the bottom of your computer and open up the Minecraft launcher. Go to the left of play and you want to select Iris and Sodium, then press play. Understand you're playing a modified version of Minecraft. Here we are. Go and pause the game and press options and then you can press video settings. Things will look slightly different as we're using Sodium and Iris. At the top, you want to press shader packs and press open shader pack folder. This will go and open up. Stay in your downloads and you can then add in the packs. You may have got multiple, I just got one. Then we can go and press Minecraft at the bottom to return to it. We can go and see it here. You want to go and select the pack and then they should go and enable it. Press apply at the bottom and then they're going to be used. We can then unpause the game. And as you can see, these look absolutely incredible. 